Welcome to Valley of the Bones Podcast. I'm your favorite felon, the Rev, Dr. Kev. How is everybody doing today? Hopefully much more blessed than stressed. Today we're on day 23 of Proverbs as Devotionals. Please like, share, subscribe, and comment. We'd like to hear from you. Please donate to the ministry. Help us continue to do all we do and to grow and to help people. If you have any questions, prayers, and anything like that, message lines are open and they're always open. Please feel free. But without further ado, let us get on to Psalms 23 on life and conduct. When you sit down to dine with the ruler, Consider carefully what is before you, and put a knife to your throat if you are a person of great appetite. Do not desire his delicacy for his deceptive food. Do not worry yourself to gain wealth. Stop dwelling on it. When you set your eyes on it, it is gone, for wealth certainly makes itself wings like an eagle that flies flies toward the heavens. Do not eat the bread of a selfish person or desire his delicacies. For as he thinks within himself, so he is. He says to you, eat and drink, but his heart is not with you. You will vomit up the morsel you have eaten and waste your compliments. Do not speak to be heard by a fool, for he will despise the wisdom of your words. Do not move the ancient boundary or go into the fields of the fatherless, for their Redeemer is strong. He will plead their case against you. Apply your heart to discipline and your ears to words of knowledge. Do not withhold discipline from a child. Though you strike him with the rod, he will not die. You shall strike him with the rod and rescue his soul from Sheol. My son, if your heart is wise, my own heart also will be glad, and my innermost being will rejoice when your lips speak what is right. Do not let your heart envy sinners, but live in the fear of the Lord always. Certainly there is a future, and your hope will not be cut off. Listen, my son, and be wise, and direct your heart in the way. Do not be heavy drinkers of wine or with gluttonous eaters of meat. For the heavy drinker and the glutton will come to poverty and the drowsiness will clothe one with rags. Listen to your father who fathered you and do not despise your mother when she is old. Buy truth and do not sell it. Get wisdom, instruction, and understanding. The father of the righteous will greatly rejoice in he who fathers a wise son will be glad in him. Let your father and your mother be glad and let her rejoice who gave birth to you. Give me your heart, my son, and let your eyes delight in my ways. For a prostitute is a deep pit and a strange woman is a narrow well. Certainly she lurks like a ro- as a robber and increases the treacherous among mankind. Who has woe? Who has sorrow? Who has contentions? Who has complaining? Who has wounds without cause? Who has red eyes? Those who linger long over wine, those who go to taste mixed wine, do not look at wine when it is red, when it sparkles in the cup, when it goes down smoothly. In the end, it bites like a snake and stings like a viper. Your eyes will see strange things and your mind will say perverse things. And you will be like one who lies down in the middle of the sea or one who lies down on the top of the mast. They struck me, but I did not become ill. They beat me, but I did not know it. When will I awake? I will seek another drink. Amen. Proverbs 23. Hope everybody's day continues to be more blessed than stressed. That's day 23. Love you guys. 
I'm your favorite fellow, the Rev Kev, and I'm 